Texas native here and uh, I'm gonna try out a new product on our deer feeders because we're having a lot of trouble with coons and uh, and squirrels and uh, I've seen these on on sportsmansguide.com and I'd also heard about them from a few friends of mine they're having also having troubles with coons and it's called shark's teeth they're about 15 to 20 dollars there's a set of three one for each leg and it comes with self-tapping sheet metal screws as well and inside the box it appears to me as it just some Simpson uh, strong ties that you'd see for some uh, framing construction they're even perforated every few inches and I thought about buying a box of these and cutting them in the in half so I could stretch my money since we have so many feeders out here but they come in seven segments each so I really can't get a nice half so I'll probably just purchase some more I mean 15 to 20 dollars is not that inexpensive considering corn is ten dollars a bag right now but uh, so three of them in there and it seems pretty sharp and what we're gonna do is we're just gonna screw them into the legs on the feeder and hopefully I can get it done with just a power drill and we'll see if that deters the animals anymore okay so we're gonna mount mount it right about here somewhere in the middle because I figure the animals gotta crawl their way up and then get to where the feeds coming out so I used one of the self-tapping screws that came with it and it went very easily in there so I got one at the top I'll probably put one in the middle somewhere say right about so right about there there we go and that's pretty tight I, I wouldn't want to climb on that if I was <laughs> a critter and then I'll put one at the base down here keep them from bending it if they do get hung up on it So it comes with three screws per, and I put one in the top, the middle, and the bottom, and there's really not that much wiggle. It probably wouldn't hurt to put a few more sheet metal screws in there, but I don't have any extra on me. <laughs> I'm serious. Okay, so it's been a couple of weeks since I put up the shark teeth, and you definitely need more sheets metal screws in there than, than the three that come with it. Because on at least two of the feeders, they've been pulled loose, so something big got on there and pulled it off. So definitely use some more screws. <laughs> 